It's a real soul to this house. And you really got that sense as soon as you came through the door. What I'm very often drawn to is something that's personal. We are conducting this incredible sale for the private collection of President and Mrs. Ronald Reagan. And this is such a unique opportunity to see how these very famous people lived in their private life. One of the things that I got most excited about, there was this wonderful Tiffany desk clock and it had a brass plaque inscribed, Good morning, Mr. President. All of our faces just lit up. What an incredible thing to own. To know that it was a personal gift from the Sinatras was kind of overwhelming. What we are seeing is the full evolution of the Billy Haynes Hollywood Regency style, refined down to what we think of as today the California lifestyle. Billy Haynes did houses for some of the greatest stars. And the business continued on with Ted Graeber, who did this house with his then partner, Peter Schifando. It's been amazing, especially getting telephone calls at the office and being told it was Mrs. Reagan, the first lady's on the phone. I was here when the house was being set up for them, when they came out of the White House. So she saw me around all the time, pushing things and putting light bulbs and lamps and that sort of thing. She liked me. And if she liked to, she liked to. We became very close, and it was a very special thing. Same colors in the bedroom as she had in the White House. Study was virtually the same, same fabric, same sofas as were in the governor's mansion. There was a very unique categorizing system that the Reagans used, which was to place a green sticker underneath each object that was in the White House and then was now in their private collection. Having that space we created must have been an important way of remembering those incredible years of their lives. Here we see a bit of the Reagan's whimsy. She clearly was having fun with this. She's got a whole herd of elephants going around the table. And of course, as we all know, the elephant is a symbol for the Republican Party. Even though this was the home of a president and a first lady, you can tell they sat on these chairs. They entertained their friends here. Some of this furniture has been with them for almost as long as they were together. Every object in this home has its own story. The conversations and the moments that they have witnessed, it does tell an American story. These are two people who kind of lived on the center stage for an enormous number of years. There are wonderful little personal mementos in this house that deal with their life together. This was a space that the Reagans really only used to welcome their closest personal friends. So to have the opportunity to see this home of theirs before it goes to a new owner is really quite extraordinary.